Repeats of Rush Limaugh's radio show will play for three hours per day until his audience is prepared to say goodbye. Network bosses have the conservative radio star died from lung cancer on Wednesday at the age of 70 following three decades as America's most popular talkback personnel. The Rush Limbaugh show was syndicated on nearly 600 radio stations nationwide between 12 and 3 p.m. Old clips of the program will now be played in that same slot so fans can be soothed by the sound of the... The announcement was made Friday in an internal memo to staff at Premier Networks, a division of iHeartMedia that oversees the program. No one can replace Rush Limbaugh, stated the memo, which was obtained by the Wall Street Journal and purportedly penned by Hosea Belcher, the senior vice president of marketing for Premier and Limaugh's show reportedly attracted a weekly audience of 15.5 million listeners, making it the most listened to radio program in the country. The conservative pundit had hosted the program since 1988. Share this article. Limaugh's fourth wife, Catherine, 44, is set to inherit the Palm Beach property, according to Reap. The radio star first picked up the estate as a vacation home in 1998 for $3.98 million, while he was married to his third wife, Fox Business reports. According to a recent estimate on Zillow, the property is now worth almost 13 times as much after he and Catherine transformed the property when they decided to move in for good back in 2010. The couple added three additional structures to the house after buying up surrounding land. Limbaugh previously owned a Fifth Avenue condo with 10 rooms and a view of Central Park, which he sold for $11.5 million. The host was worth a cool $600 million around the time of his death after earning an estimated $33 million a year for much of his. He was the second highest paid radio host in 2019 just behind Howard Stern. In January 2020, just before he announced his cancer diagnosis, Limbaugh renewed a contract with Premier Radio Networks for $70 million annually. In April last year, Forbes ranked him as the 11th highest earning celebrity of the year. He was estimated to be receiving $85 million a year at the time. Forbes also estimates that his career-long pre-tax earnings look $1 billion before his personal spending and professional costs. As well as his radio earnings, Limbaugh added to his massive fortune by streaming videos of his radio show for a fee and publishing seven books, including a five-titled children's series Rush Revere he wrote with wife. They also included New York Times bestsellers, The Way Things Ought to Be and See, I Told You. In 2008, Forbes named Limbaugh among their most generous celebrities after he donated $2 million in the previous year to the Marine Corps Law Enforcement Foundation. His annual Curathon broadcast has raised more than $47 million over the years to support the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society of America, according to the website Foundation Guy. It is not known if any of Limbaugh's three ex wives will receive any of his fortune or if Catherine, his wife of 11 years, will inherit his full as Limbaugh had no children.